The world has thrived towards modern day living, ignoring the natural habitat that actually controls our Mother Earth. One of the wildlife animals that seems to be facing difficulties getting used to this harsh environment is the orangutan. Commercially, orangutans are known to be quiet and reserved primates, hanging onto tree branches and can be aggressive when they feel threatened. Orangutans are now highly threatened with extinction and survive only in the fragmented rainforests of Borneo and Sumatra. Orangutans can only live up to 45 years maximum. It is very unfortunate that there will always be a darkest side in the world they live in, which few of us knew. Why are orangutans in danger? The deforestation and degradation of our tropical rainforests, particularly the lowland forest, threatens orangutans with the possibility of extinction. Deforestation, especially for the benefit of pot pepper and oil palm plantations, as well as illegal human activities such as logging and wildlife trade, are among the threats that the orangutans are still facing. Forest fire and drought have also contributed to the loss of their habitats. The populations of wild orangutan are currently in a trend of decline and may soon pass the point of no return if nothing were to be done. Actions needed to be taken if we were to save the orangutan species from extinction. One of the solutions to protect endangered orangutan is to avoid products made with unsustainable palm oil. As you all know that the rainforests are cleared to make some spaces for palm oil plantation. This activity causes the orangutans to lose their homes. How to avoid products that contain palm oil? This is basically from our choices that can make a difference. Palm oil is used in so many products, so that is why we need to choose products made from deforestation free palm oil. Meanwhile, the solution to stop deforestation is by joining a community forestry project. Community forestry is carried out by the local residents, volunteers, and schools or college with the support of the government. These projects involve tree planting, timber harvesting, cleaning, and forest conservation. In this way, we could at least protect the endangered species such as orangutans. This is because every endangered species also needs homes and need to be protected. How can you help us to save orangutan? Firstly, supporting the Center for Orangutan Protection, for example, Sepiluk Orangutan Rehabilitation Center. This is the one of many ways we can help orangutan conservation. We can support and at the same time we can donate to the charity by visiting our donation pages. Secondly, join volunteer program. Join this program we can raise awareness and lead by example. How can we help us save orangutan is by participating this program. We can learn more about how to preserve wildlife. Just as the Wildlife Conservation Society in Malaysia strive to inspire the public throughout science and education to be more active in conserving orangutan and various dangerous animals. In conclusion, we need to protect all the endangered species to maintain the ecosystems and a healthy ecological balance.